what's up everybody this is living local 409 this is part three where we're looking at the boxes continuing where we left off i am so happy to show you the rest of these boxes some of them are so amazing and i was thankful i was able to research more and find out more about these artists i also want to say a uh, heartfelt um condolences to making Cobb's husband i heard that he had a uh untimely passing uh this was all recorded before i knew that but i wanted to say that so uh let's get to the paintings and of course we got our girl caroline back and i think she did two sides let me see yes she did so let's get she always i love her art too really nice i always loved her art because to me it's like the perfect Sunday morning cartoons or Saturday morning cartoons I mean I just love that art it just brings nostalgia of how art used to be all right so as you can see we're here at the we're here at the other boxes and we got his we got two uh, murals that are paying homage to rap royalty we got Tupac by Henry Smith Henry Art Smith, I always like Henry Art Smith artwork, and then we have uh, my bo boy Biggie on here with the with the crown on, iconic picture. Let's keep going. Actually, let's go this way, <laughs> so you can see a better image of Tupac paying that homage. And I didn't even realize he did this one. Um, I didn't even realize he did this one. He's got the wings. I always like Henry Art Smith's work. Oh, it's another one by Caroline. I wonder why she did them so far apart. Maybe she was late to get another box. I love her birds. They're like a cartoon type vibe. Oh, and now I know who this is. This is Two Throat Art. Yeah, I remember I did. Uh, they did another one that I found. Gotta remember whichever one they did. But of course, this is the box. Let's get to the next one. Then we got the pink license plate with the bricks in the back. Huh, I wonder who, uh, I wonder if that's the name of the person that did it or not. Because I don't see a signature anywhere. <laughs> I wonder if that signature is the 1838, but I don't know. It's kind of weird she didn't put her signature. I've seen her working on it during Mural Fest, but she doesn't have her name anywhere. Let's go on to the next box. I mean, not the next box, the next side of the box. We got Whisk Hard and Stack Often. So Mural Dreamers, I, I told you in the, the uh, Mural Fest video that I love this one basically because i love pancakes and i love eggs so i actually do whisk hard and stack often <laughs> meal dreamers you did a great job on this one let's go to the next side now this is the one that's kind of interesting because i don't know exactly what this is but um it's very abstract but nicely done beaumont texas where music lives Brittany door did this one uh look at the symbolism of it i don't know that looks kind of mayan an inspiration or maybe not i don't know uh but i will say awesomely done now suzette i, I told you i love suzette sorry she did that swan and of course she did another banger here look at that the forest creatures i told you last time i seen it was awesome but she wasn't really finished the last meal fest so let's do a close-up on the different designs that they are like of course you got the owl with the two uh mice on them looking really nice you got the yeti in the background and it's holding a, a cup of coffee it looks like <laughs> that's so funny you got the opossums i know it's just possum but i love saying opossum um then of course you got the <laughs> you got the fox with uh, playing a guitar. Oh no! Look look at the skunk. <laughs> you got the raccoon, the raccoon, the mama or daddy raccoon. Don't know, but they got the the uh, marshmallows, the bunnies. Armadillo is ba is is uh, dancing. 
with another opossum. The deer is dancing. They got the deer in the background watching them from afar. All kind of detail in this. Even the back trees look so amazingly done. Great job, Suzette. I know I'm, I'm bragging on this one. I always just like, I love when it has so many little details in it. Expressive, you know. Great job, Suzette. So let's look at this. This is Megan Cobb's work. You remember I talked about it on festival. I was kind of surprised she went this route with it. But we're gonna start with this raccoon first. I will say she is so talented. Um, it looks like she named all of them. <laughs> so we have Pepper here. Pepper the raccoon. <laughs> I will say, man, look how awesome that is. Look how awesome that is. Nicely done. Let's move on to the next one. So, bye, Pepper. Let's see, who's this next one? <laughs> Nutra rats. <laughs> I mean, if you ever seen a Nutra rat, it is looking like that. You might want to either run or shoot if you got a gun. But, uh,. <laughs> Them things are huge, and little teeth are huge. But anyway, nicely done. I love the colors. Again, this person, this uh, Nutra Rat is considered Electra is the name. So nicely done. How you doing, Electra? And I love that she put what they are, so you don't have to guess. But you can kind of get from the place. But of course, we got Opossum. Our possum. <laughs> oh no, she named this one Karen. All right, it's already going, you know, so guess it's acting like a Karen. <laughs> but look, it's got the hearts though. It says J and C. <laughs> That's just funny. All right, let's move on. <laughs> and then we got a little mousy. It actually looks cute. I love the little mousy. Well done, well done. Reginald, it's got a little fancy name, Reginald. And this one says MNG, and it says Zara. I wonder if she had other people help her or something. I did see a guy helping her paint, but that was the only one I seen, but um, anyway, I love that flower at the top. I wish that she would have colored that in. That looks really amazing, but anyway, all right, Reginald, we'll talk to you later, Reginald. Next up, we got Valerie, and I really do love this. My son actually loved this the most because he's into space. And uh, when he seen that astronaut, he just had to run to it and just stare at it and go, wow. <laughs> so good job, Valerie. Um, I just love the creativeness with the butterflies and flowers with an astronaut. He must be hot. But anyway, uh, <laughs> The clouds make it look even better. I love when you make dreamy clouds like that. So good job, Valor. Next up, we have Bayou Arts. I actually have the pleasure of talking to him. Uh, he had me laughing because he said he had to stay away from it because every time he looked at it, he wanted to just keep adding on more and more. But nonetheless, such an amazing drawing, uh, such an amazing mural, um, the detail that's in those trees i believe that's in the background the detail that's in them uh just the little designs the way the wolf is set up it's just amazing uh he did such an awesome job um i i really applaud it but anyway look how close i'm getting close so you can see look at the detail that's within these trees they look so awesome <laughs> like this is an awesome looking mural uh shouts out to bayou Next up is Buccelli. I got to talk to him too. I actually got to watch him paint some uh, amazing, ha nice guy. He really did talk to me. Didn't have to. It was right in the middle of his painting and he let me uh, video him painting. Super nice guy. But I also love on Instagram, he, he has little videos where he talk about every symbol and building that's on there. And it's super creative because he talks about the history of uh, I actually I don't want to spoil it for I'll let you go to his Instagram follow him and he will tell you all about it but look at the background that's what just amazed me it's the background too the, the way that the trees are with the grass 
it just contrasts so amazingly with that gold paint. Uh, I, I love it. I love it. Um, and just really, really amazingly done. Shouts out to you, Mr. Buccelli. And I love this one too because it's like, it's like arts and crafts. That's what I, I think it is. It's like arts and crafts to me, the way that it did it. Like, it looks like everything is woven. It's kind of, <laughs> kind of how I got the, with a lattice uh, Texas sign. And I love that it has the Beaumont, Texas there. Art of Sunny, great job. Hats off, chef's kiss to you. You did a great job. You cooked this one to perfection, <laughs> to use food terms. But I love it. Awesome job. The little bees with the, the blue bonnets, sunflowers. Oh, just just awesome. Even just look at the look at the way that the butterfly is done. Done is such a good way. I love it. Good job, Sonny. Well, that's it for the boxes. So now we're going to be doing the last video that are going to have the rest of the murals. That's right. The rest that was done during Mural Fest. So you don't want to miss that. Shouts out to all of the artists. I hope that you go follow them, look at them, support them, and enjoy everything they got. Peace. <laughs>